My name is Amy Knoll. I'm the unit manager of the Transitions Program at Seven Counties. Transitions works with families who have been separated by abuse or neglect. We offer evidence-based trauma treatment to families involved in the child protection and court systems, as well as a variety of parenting programs to assist with reunification of families. In our protective parenting program, parents talk about what led up to the neglect of their children, the impact that it's had on their family, and talk about ways they can keep it from happening in the future by developing a safety plan. We offer this program in a group setting so that other parents can support each other in their treatment. I'd like to introduce Shannon. She came to us after her daughter had been removed from her care. Shannon participated in our program and was so open and honest about her mistakes. She was willing to do whatever was necessary to help her daughter and re her. Welcome, Shannon. Hello, thank you. Can you tell us about what brought you to Seven Counties? I had an open CPS case for child neglect for my daughter and my social worker required a protective parenting course that was court ordered. What were your thoughts after you attended your first protective parenting group? I was skeptical at first and was very curious as to what kind of personal experience I'm going to have to share with a group of strangers and also with counselors that report back to my CPS worker to see if I am fit to be a good mom and a good person. The accountability statement is what really snapped me back to reality. It really holds you accountable for your behavior, your actions, and got me to where I am. My first task was my trauma experience after a certain age, and I was going to be digging deep with this group. After the first session, I was open to suggestions and was willing to get honest and do the work because there were other people in the group doing the same thing and the counselors were just so positive and they had constructive feedback. What kept you coming back to group? And the system was willing to give me a second chance. The counselors in my group were not only willing to hold us and me accountable and work with us, but they truly wanted to help us, to see us see a different perspective. Another reason I kept coming back is that it was really helping my relationship with my daughter and it was working. I really needed the wake up call. Can you share about how participating and learning more about yourself has impacted your lives? Well, after going through these tasks and doing the work, writing my amends apology letter to my daughter and reading it to my daughter, our relationship was dramatically changed in a positive way. Because of this program, I've developed an awareness and have been given some valuable tools to improve our everyday life. Every day we have check-ins, you know, how is your head, how is your heart, and how is your body? And I am listening and hearing my daughter's needs and wants and talking through with her. I am looking at situations from her perspective more. We're doing more activities together that strengthen our teamwork. And I'm digging deeper into myself, being more aware of my character defects and continuously working on my spiritual growth and getting out from this blanket of denial. Thank you. Is there anything else you wanna tell other parents about the Protective Parenting Program? I believe in second chances. I believe that there is always an opportunity for growth. In my experience, the protective parenting course constructively guided me and gave me the perspective that I absolutely needed to be a better mother. It really forced me to take a look, closer look into myself and give me the strength to be the woman that I was always meant to be. Thank you, Shannon, for your strength and your courage to share your story to help others. To request this parenting group or any of our therapy or addiction services, please give us a call at 502-589-1100 or go to our website to request a first appointment at sevencounties.org. Thank you.